So, which would you prefer? Would you prefer the hardcore truth so it can adapt and change? Or do you want the truth sugar-coated so therefore you swallow it easy? Never short stopping, now I'm winning like I'm Jida. Steady through the rigor, yeah I'm getting bigger. We're fighting in them trenches, now I'm making seven figures like... What's cracking everybody? Money Smart Guy, Matt Zapala here. Hailing to you from the beaches of Maui. Here, wrapping up our trip here with 450 of our top guys in our company. And one of the things I shared with people when they come on board to our mentoring system, when they come into our industry, when they come into our company, and people have dreams and desire to want to be financially free, debt free, financially independent, calling their own shots, being their own boss is, are you willing to handle the truth? Because once you know the truth and you understand your current reality, then you can make changes. But here's one of the scariest things that a lot of people are afraid of these days. I don't know why, but people have a hard time listening to the truth uh, because it's not said to them in the right way. Listen, I know I was in the Marine Corps. I know I spent eight years in, in the service. I know a lot of you may or may have not, or you've not participated in sports or been in some form of competitive environment. But I want you to understand this. I'd love for you to understand this. Not everything is to be said the way you want it. Not everything is to be said the way you wish it'd be said to you. It's the sad reality of where a lot of people today in America is that it's so sensitive to bring up a lot of topics and subjects so therefore people can adapt and change. So what do I bring this up to you? We ask these folks, what type of life did you sign up for? When we ask these folks, what do you want to accomplish? When we ask these folks, what do you want to do? Who do you want to become? I want to be financially free, financially independent, all, all that, right? Yada, yada, yada. And then we get to specifics, like how much is financial freedom? How much does it cost each month to raise uh, your kids in the, in the right school system? How much does it cost each month to take care of your parents? And then there's no answers. There's no specifics. So I tell the guys here, listen, if you come in board in our system, in our platform, around our circle of friends, our circle of business, don't expect for you to like me. I'm, however, I think I'm a likable guy. I love to have fun. I love to have a blast. I love to joke around. I love to pull pranks. But there's a switch to me. There's a flip to me to the serious side that says, you know what? I'm about my business. I'm about to make my dreams, my life different. I'm about to improve my current situation. So my question to you is this. Do you want me in your life so that you can have another friend? Or do you want a guy or a gal in your life a mentor, a coach that could actually change your life for the better. Because you may not like me now. I may not like the coaching, may not like the accountability, may not like the call outs. But if you're willing to listen, adapt, change, and implement the things we ask you to do, because it may not be the way you want to hear it, but it's the truth. Tell me then when you're debt free. Tell me then when you're financially free. Tell me then when you take care of pants. Tell me then what that feels like with our toes in the sand. You have a drink in your hand, tell me then how much you don't like me. Do you have something like that in your life? I hope so. That being said, guys, drop your thoughts, your comments, your follow-up questions, your ideas. So therefore you can one day enjoy these type of things. Even in the midst of the pandemic, you are rising above financially, emotionally, spiritually. You're rising above the situation because you chose not to have a position of comfort but a position where you're changing, adapting, and improving your life every step of the way with your toes in the sand. That being said, guys, if you're watching this on Facebook, make sure you click like, follow our Facebook page, My Smart Guy. If you're watching this on YouTube, make sure you click subscribe, hit notification, be alerted next time we upload our next episode. That being said, guys, from the beaches of Maui, I'm your Money Smart Guy. And until we meet again, continue to live smart, continue to love smart, and be money smart today. God bless you guys. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.